NIU English professor and poet Amy Newman thinks of herself first as a teacher and has already been honored with the university's Excellence in Undergraduate Teaching Award. Her career, however, didn't start that way. In the mid-1980s, Newman was working in New York as a stylist for television commercials when she found something that would change her career path. There were old New Yorker magazines on the table, so I opened one up. It fell open to a Stanley Plumley poem, and the moment that I read it, I could sort of feel all of um, difficult and unhappy landscapes of my present experience fall away, and I remembered that I used to love to read poetry, so I thought, I guess I have to go back to university and study poetry again. In her 15 years at NIU, Newman's poetry has won critical praise, national prizes, and international attention. She has written three books of poetry and an additional 200 poems, some of which have appeared in prestigious anthologies and have been translated into foreign languages. When Newman's father asked her to write a poem about her mother, who had recently passed away, she began thinking about how to express grief. The result is one of her most personal books entitled Fall. The idea of, of the fall, which is um, something that a lot of people mention when they talk about grief, occurred to me. I went to the dictionary just to look up the word, sort of as a part of my research, and I was uh, astounded to see that the word has 72 definitions. I just read the definitions through and they seemed to be telling me a story. And then, then I, so I took each definition and tried to write a poem in response to it. Amy's book, uh, Fall, exemplifies um, her work as a poet in that uh, she's a poet of, of ideas. She's a poet who, um, in this book, explores all of the dimensions of um, a particular word of the English language and all the ways that that word and an exploration of it moves. Well, Amy's unusual because uh, she is not only a poet, she's also a literary scholar, and she publishes widely. Uh, critical essays. So when she teaches, she brings to her teaching uh, all of the background and knowledge that other PhDs and uh, literary periods uh, bring to the task.